I will try to highlight in the next 30 minutes the approach to the hands-on scanning of the fetal heart and um, important moments that and the uh, protocols that can be followed to um, make the screening for congenital heart anomalies the most effective. And we will look at the, some tips and tricks for the practical approach. So this is just a reminder that the approach to the early cardiac imaging can be performed in settings of the screening examination and in the settings of the detailed exam, which is the fetal echocardiogram. So as we remember, the screening examination performed on everybody, usually transabdominal ultrasound is used. We can orient ourselves using the direct and indirect markers. It generally requires that the people who perform screening in the first trimester would be familiar with the um, criteria for the nuchal translucency measurement and will have the basic training with the addition of the NTQR or FMF certification. So usually this type of the exam of the heart performed in the OB MFM settings in the gestational age between 11 and 14 weeks gestation. And most of the time we use B mode and that occasionally can be accompanied by Doppler ultrasound. So detailed exam, this is a um, completely different story. So we perform that based on indications. Again, in the first trimester, we have an advantage of the transvaginal ultrasound, and I will demonstrate how we can achieve that. We use the multiple planes, extra training and expertise is required from the operator, sonographer, or the reading physician. Um, we usually need to involve the pediatric cardiologist specialist and the optimal time based on our experience, uh, usually between 14 and 16 weeks. And we can use different modalities, including 2D, all types of Dopplers, and of course, stick a volume ultrasound.